what's up guys it's flex and welcome back so today i'm back working on the engine of my mercedes c300 i really want to tune the car to get more horsepower but there's one more thing under the hood that i need to change immediately and this can benefit a regular c300 or even a c300 that has mods on it like my car and what i'm going to be changing out today is the air tube that leads into the intake on this car so upgrading that air tube from a plastic air tube to something a lot better is definitely going to increase its durability so it lasts a lot longer and also it's going to keep the air colder colder air means more performance so after driving a car for a while the engine gets really hot and all the plastic tubing is going to hold a lot of heat that heat is going to reduce a lot of horsepower so you could lose anywhere from 15 percent to 30 percent horsepower by keeping plastic piping on your car. So again, upgrading that pipe is definitely gonna benefit the car and help the car maintain horsepower even when the engine gets hot. And I wanna thank Tornado Tuning for sponsoring this video and providing me with the upgraded pipe. And if you want more information on this pipe, definitely check out the information in the description below. So now, let's get to the install. So here is my engine bay with the engine cover removed. Just a quick recap. I did an aftermarket air intake kit from Tornado Tuning. This is all aluminum with heat resistant coating and it's also been hydro dipped to give it a carbon fiber style. I also did the same thing for the turbo charge pipe. Again, all aluminum, heat resistant coating. And of course, I also upgraded the inner cooler. This is also from Tornado Tuning and this is all aluminum and slightly larger than stock. Also down here, I upgraded the diverter valve to a DV+. So the issue here is that the air going into the intake still runs through this plastic pipe. This plastic pipe is known to fail a lot and also it's plastic so it soaks a lot of heat. So I'm gonna be upgrading that today to this. So here is the three piece air tube from Tornado Tuning. So it has some flex to it. This is high quality silicone. This is also high quality aluminum, heat resistant coating, and it's been hydro dipped to look like carbon fiber. This way it matches everything on the engine. I mean, look at the quality. It's really nice. And it also comes with the included clamps and it's really easy to install. This pipe is actually pretty easy to remove. I'm just gonna grab some pliers and there's a piece right here that I just need to twist so it's horizontal instead of vertical. And once it is horizontal, I can literally yank the pipe right out. Now time to put the new one on. Here's a three piece pipe, fully assembled. What I did was I tried to adjust it as much as possible so it's about the same length and same shape as the OEM pipe. I didn't clamp these down all the way yet, they're still loose if I need to make any adjustments, but it was a struggle to push this in. So what I did was I actually used some soapy water and it was able to slip right in. So now this is ready to go back on the car. Well, there you have it. I hope you guys like this upgrade. It was super easy to do and it looks really cool on my car. And if you're interested in this air tube or any of the other components underneath the hood of my car, definitely go check out Tornado Tuning. I'll leave their information in the description below. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you do, hit like below. As always, make sure you subscribe and I will see you next time.